No, we're, we're not going to assault the, lo the elusive man space right now, guys. We're going to put a pin in that. We still have a DLC to conquer, and it's a chonky one. I'm so excited <laughs> that we're finally here. <laughs> this is one yeah. of those... This is one of those moments in the trilogy where you're like when someone who doesn't know what's about to happen you're like sitting there all like giddy like yeah 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 <laughs> <laughs> so like at the beginning of the game because it, the triggers in this game are poorly optimized at the beginning of the game we were basically given the key to Anderson's apartment on the Citadel and was like, hey man, take Hackett was like, take some shore leave, that's an order, and we didn't. <laughs> right. So it's time for some shore leave. We're gonna take oh, shore leave. Nice. That is fancy ass apartment. I've got It's so fancy. Shepard. Admiral, how are you holding up? Day by day, Commander. Yeah. Hackett sent me a message about this apartment. I want you to have it. Take it off my hands. Are you serious? You need a place that's yours. Somewhere to recharge, clear your head. Kaylee wanted us to settle down there. Thing is, the longer I'm on Earth, the less I want to leave. Nice place, damn. It's super there. fancy. Like I said, you'd be doing me a favor. <laughs> no. Well, don't don't mind if I do. Pass Thank you. you. <laughs> it's practical. We need you in the best shape possible. Rested. Focus. You can do this DLC so. at any time. Thank you. Okay, cool. but it's yours now. Honestly, I agree with everyone sure manage. who's like okay. mm, about okay. now and the story is a good time talk to you soon. cool it's it's kind of a good time because it's like we're about to do a big thing i think it's time for some right. time <laughs> take sure. care anderson <laughs> be careful out there anderson you too Shepard. okay explore apartment Damn, this qualifies as an apartment. This is an apartment. Well, like I mean, to be fair, he was feet. he was the first human counselor, so he probably has some money. True, true. That's fair. That's fair. That's amazing. My wife just called. My ex-wife. Nobody likes to talk about the toll that long months apart can have oh my God. on military relationships. Dude. She wasn't military. She couldn't handle it. But it's not even about military and non-military. Damn it, it's space flight. Space flight. Finding the mass relays, miracles of engineering. Human imagination rising to meet our desires. We pay a price for that curiosity, that drive. Our relationships suffer. People we love suffer. But that's reality. And it's worth the cost. I must have thought it was. I guess I still do. In the end, you just have to hope you made the right choice. Are you seriously going to make that beeping noise the whole time we're walking around the apartment? Please. <laughs> yeah, it is. Okay, hang on. Okay. Dinner at sushi place on me. <laughs> Yo, that's my favorite place. Sushi place. <laughs> Hey, Shepard, I've got a few things I wanted to go over with you. With the Normandy and Dry Dock, I figured we could meet up at that Ryuse sushi place down in the wards. I hear it's the best. Joker! Oh, okay, all right. Um, Sounds good. Um, there's a catalog, and we can change. We can do man... We don't have options right now, but... um. There is a there's a place where we can buy stuff and we can change ah. uh they're minor changes but we can change the look of the apartment. That's cute. Yeah. That's cute. Cute little cute little thing. He's got good taste in art. I like the stuff. Yeah. That's cool. No, no, it's fine. I got a few minutes. First contact war? Yeah. I was there. My first real combat. First for a lot of us. I remember one night early in the war. Trapped in my seat as our transport approached the LZ. Everyone was dead silent. Just the sound of breathing. Good men. I trained with all of them. We were always joking and horsing around, but not this time. 
<laughs> you little jerk. <laughs> oh my god. Wow, me walking to the fireplace? I'm sorry. Excuse me, PDA. Oh, I've, I've, and the reason why we're doing this now is because it makes the... Just, just get it out of the way. Sure. There's right. a bunch of these hidden around the apartment. Get a little background on Anderson. Look at, look at that wall! Whoa. It's Independence Day, man! <laughs> right. What was out there? If we were alone in the universe, now we knew. We weren't alone. And we were in trouble. So there we were. About to face an enemy as different and unknown as we could imagine. I knew I had to say something to keep the men relaxed. So I turned to the soldier beside me, Hendrix, I think, and asked him how his mother was doing. Uh, that's not funny, but okay. Brutal. <laughs> Gosh. It just takes a yo mama joke. <laughs> a yo mama joke will... Well, yeah, it's gonna let him know it's gonna be alright. <laughs> The yo mama joke that saved humanity. <laughs> what was I talking about? Early days, right? Mm -hmm. Early days. And I'm not gonna walk away from this card table because apparently that's gonna make you like. But that's never the whole truth. It's been a while since I sat there. It is. I didn't recall. Did you now, Anderson? Oh, that is. Mm -hmm. Somebody had a good line right there, and they were like, "Well, how do we make that feel fit in?" Okay, so when he was a kid, there was this dog, right? <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> hey, it was Kalisa. Mm -hmm. Can you describe your first day of training in this now famous program? The Interplanetary Combatives Training Program is all business from day one. How so? We're given basic gear, then separated and stranded on an asteroid with no nav data. The test ends when the last person runs out of oxygen. Sounds daunting. Sounds brutal. <laughs> And a little bit of, like, like recklessness. <laughs> Not <laughs> Just gotta throw that out there. Well, does the program <laughs> man, or do you think you were born for this? It's a bit of both, I suppose. Every soldier reaches a point in their career, sometimes more than once, when they are asked to give more than they ever thought they could. That moment is the test. I've seen men and women, almost sure to fail, persevere long past the point. Uh-huh. 
that experience changes them. Others, with all the gifts and abilities, don't mind me. <laughs> Just done. I'm done. <laughs> I've had a few, none of which I'd like to share. But uh, I think the toughest tests are still ahead of me. What makes you say that? Call it a hunch. Soldier's intuition? Something like that. Do you trust your intuition? I mean, do you <laughs> Be great if I could run around the apartment and look at everything while you guys are talking. <laughs> right. Yeah, I'm gonna just thank you. That yeah, conversation is over. <laughs> oh look, it's a little Normandy. Oh, <laughs> oh we got some more art. That light fixture is crazy. The, yeah, these wild light things. I, spikies. I don't know. Yeah. Stereo Weird. control. Is it the same terrible music? I hear nothing. Yep, it's... Oh, I hear it, yeah. It's pretty bad. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Ayo. Let's go. <laughs> Boots with the fur. Ah. You never heard a complaint. Never once got no, sir. I can't do that. She never hesitated. Few people know what Shepard's been through. I'd like to think I come pretty close. Bam, 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 bam. There's a whole bunch of people who lose sleep over her getting back home. Maybe it doesn't need to be said. Maybe we're too dumb to say it. Soldiers like the Oh, really? I'm not sure how to take that, Anderson, but thank you. It was a compliment. <laughs> well, it's loud around here. All right, let's go. Embarrassing moments? I've got more of those than anyone will ever know. Only way to learn something. Like all these fake fireplaces. Or is it's it supposed so, to be real? It seems I can't. cozy. Seems really cozy, but yeah, does not look. Yeah, it looks fake. Like maybe it's a screen, mm -hmm. but maybe it could. Maybe it was an actual fire. Are we talking about a bar brawl, Anderson? What were you talking about? <laughs> what it sounds like. <laughs> I like that. I don't actually know. I was so wasted. A Salarian. Move like a damn cat, I swear. When everybody was out cold. Dancing behind the bar. He walked over and helped me up. N70 asked. Yes, sir, I replied. He looked over my collection of unconscious friends, nodding. Not bad. Woo! 
Okay, let's see. All right, so this is just first floor. Um, let's see, we got a nice, nice. little kitchen. Yeah. We've got, we got, we, we got, we got bathrooms out the wazoo in this place. They're everywhere. Wow. We, we got a punching bag. <laughs> oh. Wow, just that, just to the closet. Not allowed. <laughs> wow. But I think I know what you're after. You're referring to the way I um, arranged to have the Normandy released to Commander Shepard. About the time we technically committed a court martial offense. <laughs> <laughs> I would have gladly accepted the repercussions. The real trick is never being wrong. <laughs> if you're looking for more action and less philosophy in these notes, let me know. Like, pfft, I'm sorry. It's the future. We've got the we got our we got our computer screen and the what is going on oh, there? What is good. that even about? Look at these stairs. <laughs> Like, yeah, we have managed just all your prescriptions and stuff. Uh, you're right. It's not, I like this That's not a bad idea. I like this one. That's pretty. That's cool, yeah. Oh, God, more. You asked me to talk about the SSV Normandy. The Normandy Another bathroom. Hey, look, we have a reflection. Ah, uh, cool. I'm sure I'm making some of you dizzy doing this. Doesn't <laughs> I apologize. Fucking Garrus, how did you end up with your name? These fucking Victus Uh fucking um what was that one guy? Septimus. Like got these like Roman fucking names. <laughs> right, right. I guess the Primark is technically Adrian. Yeah, he had that ship for like two seconds before it became ours. Oh, <laughs> right. oh yeah, look at look at the frame rate die. Ooh. <laughs> right. Ooh. Oh. Oh dear, hang on. Oh no. Oh no, there's something at my door. <laughs> Part of this entire you'll see. Oh god, here, hang on, buddy. Careful with the controller. Hang on. <laughs> Let's see. Make sure I put the correct earbuds back in. There we go. Okay, yeah, come on, buddy. Come sit. Come sit. Okay, there we go. Let me make a note. Cat at 16 minutes. <laughs> In here, buddy. Here, I got a blankie for you, too. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, there we go. Get under the blankie. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. All good. Alrighty. Oh, excuse me. Couches. Actual <laughs> books. Picture frames with no pictures in them, I don't... Please. 
<laughs> Look at this. There's a bunch of them. What are those supposed to be? That is weird. I guess there's supposed to be screens that you can, like, program? I don't know. Yeah. David Edward. <laughs> anyway, where was I? It was a second marriage for my parents. They were almost 50 by the time they had me. Dang. My mother worked shifts. Jeez. So my father would often take me to the base. While he worked, I watched transport ships and fighters take off. Worked his whole life around space travel, my father. But he never left Earth. Not for a day. He was a good man. Just a side note. Don't put that in. Who is it, Keely? Oh, yes, I need to take that. I hope this is what you're after. I'll get to the more interesting N7 stuff next time. So, yeah, you know, he, he and Kaylee hanging out. The Turian. Right. They don't have to, though. I'm just saying. Right. <laughs> that is true. And if you do find General Oryx, oh my god. Let me know. I owe you money. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we we got a we got a bend. We uh, we 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 got a locker. We got a hot tub. Whoa, that is nice. Yeah. We got a hot tub. Let's go. And you know. Joker's taking us out to dinner. What do you say we put the dress on? Sure. Heck yeah. We're, well, going, I mean, we're going to a fancy We look like that place. in the dress. Let's do that. Yes. Yeah, right? <laughs> right? More art. So much art. Look at all this arting. <laughs> All right, Shep, I think I think we have finally conquered the PDAs. I think we're ready to go to dinner. This music is hilarious. Look at this place. It's so fancy. Tiberius Towers. Let's go. Oh. Look at all this money. <laughs> Amazing. Whoa. side-eyed by all the people online. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Commander Shepard, your table is ready. Ah oh, yes, the French metal D. <laughs> Look at the fish. Whoa, that's amazing. Look at this place. This is cool. 
This is crazy cool. How's everybody? What? What? I'm sorry. Ma Hang on. Wait. Did they? Is that your hair, ma'am? Like I don't dislike it. I'm just. It looks like it looks like one of like the Asari matriarchs like little hat things. So I and I've oh. never. <laughs> I don't think I've seen. These guys are particularly still. It's kind of freaking me out. I don't think they're supposed to be this still. Hashtag right. legendary. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but yeah, these two, these two in particular, these two ladies, they have faces and hair that like don't exist on other characters. We heard. Isn't that strange? That's very strange. Is that a shark? Did I just see a small shark swim by? Whoa. Or was. Maybe it was just that one fish had like a. I don't know. You love this place, do you now? <laughs> and then at this table we have we've got the twins each having dates at different tables. Um, right. So is this French sushi? Oh, of course. French sushi, huh? <laughs> Hello. Would the lady go for a drink? Maybe later. I'm meeting a friend. Very good. Enjoy your evening. Nice place, Joker. Hey, hey cool. Sarah, not bad, huh? The sushi place is serious. It's like, very serious. This guy at the door is serious. Only had to <laughs> save the galaxy twice to get a table here. You see the line outside? But here I am, drink in hand. <laughs> Best pilot in the universe. And a rock star. <laughs> Any news from the Normandy? Oh, uh, you know, maintenance stuff. It's hard knowing a bunch of strangers are poking around in my ship. I, I mean, your ship. It's a Joker. It's everybody's ship. Yeah. The best thing we can do right now is Parker and let the techs do their work. <sighs> yeah, you're right. Maybe an oil change, space tire rotation. <laughs> right. Trust me, it'll do her some good. Oh, I trust you. Not sure about those shifty aerospace engineers. Always stealing the silverware. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is a vacation. <laughs> someone else did work for once. Hackett's orders. Literally yeah, Hackett's really. orders. <laughs> yeah, whether we like yeah. Or not. I'm sure you'll manage. I may need a drink that comes with an umbrella. I'm the first team <laughs> inspector. I'll get you two umbrellas. Awesome use of power, boss. <laughs> so, your email said it was important? My email. I'm here because I got a message from you. The hell? I, I didn't send anything. Uh oh. Mm -hmm. Commander! Excuse me. Sorry. Nine's business. Commander, this is urgent! I don't think that's the umbrella lady. Commander Shepard, I'm staff analyst Maya Brooks. Alliance, excuse me, Alliance Intelligence. There are people trying to kill you. <laughs> yeah, I think she's aware of that. <sighs> no, I don't mean Cerberus and the Reapers. I mean other people, new people. There, it's, <sighs> someone is hacking your account. Comm channels, personal records. They're targeting you specifically. Uh, yeah, why? Why this identity theft? Targeting me. <laughs> What's going on here? Intel isn't definitive yet. Last time, I guess without definitive intel, we almost landed troops on a gas giant, which is bad. Hang on, Brooks. Take a breath. <laughs> From the top, what do you know? Excuse me, you don't have a reservation. Oh. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Tonight's performance is brought to you by Random Acts of Violence. Get down! Man, I love show business. Spread out, boys. Find me Shepard. Stay there. I'm coming. Joker. Ow, my pancreas. 
Hey! Oh. Damn it! Got one, sir! Find the crew. I'm going after her. Find the crew. Got it. <laughs> yeah. We're coming. Where'd you get a gun? I don't need a gun. <laughs> right? Which is one of the most fun parts about being a biotic. I don't need ammo. I don't give a crap about avoiding detection. Are you kidding me? Like, use their suppressors so nobody knows you're actually killing them. I think that time has passed. Right? Staying down. Brooks. Oh no. Shit. Well, I just broke all my ribs, but I'm okay. Graham. I do like that we have sensible shoes. Are you okay down there? That's very important. Yeah, we're doing great. <laughs> no meta gel. Brooks. Whoops. You got hit. I know. I used meta gel. A lot of it. Um, all of it, actually. I know everything is a little bit bouncy. I think you used too much. So, can I help with anything? <laughs> Alert c -Sec. I'll look for a way out. So, I, I'm just sitting here, I'm like, so Metagel is full of morphine, got it. Okay. <laughs> right, okay. I'm gonna go on this way. Who the hell even said that? That was way too close <laughs> to my ear balls. <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> I'm doing my best, little be little guy. Guys, I don't care if the current temperature units still work. Put the new ones in all along this section. The customer has permits and wants the work to start immediately. Even paid up front with a crazy bonus. Get it done. Back Frakes, Citadel Air. Warning, this area is unsafe. Sounds safe. I see some sky cars across the gap. Maybe a landing pad. I'm checking the area. Hi. Hi. Get a shuttle over there. I'll find a way across. Okay, right. Oh, keep going down. This area is going to So, um, it turns out CSEC has the whole area locked down. Area it's going to be a tiny bit tricky to get you a shuttle. Keep at it, Brooks. Oh, also, stay off your calm. Well, except for me. It's hacked. That's probably how they found you. Who are these guys? I don't know. But they really don't seem to like you. Yeah, I'm sensing that. Yeah. <laughs> I'm getting that impression. <laughs> yeah. Hey, look. Fish. Whoa. That is a big fish. Yeah. Hey. Hello. Oh, hi. You on your smoke break? <laughs> like, he's just oh. like, hi. <laughs> he's it's not like, get out of here. Or, okay. Hey, man, I'm on my break. He's like, hey. Yeah, right? It's like, excuse me, what are you doing with a gun? And it's like, oh, hello. <laughs> Right. I need to get to my shop. Cesek shut the whole area down. Cesek did shut the whole area down. Open the door. 
delay detection by hiding and using the suppress pistol to stop Mercs from calling for help. I don't give a fuck, dude. Man down! Let's go! <laughs> Let's boogie! Peace. Hey! You okay? I'm fine. Might need a little backup. Lucky for you, Archangel is your boyfriend. Joker filled me in. <laughs> Be there as fast as I can. Excuse me, who is this? You're on an unsecured channel and you're putting Commander Shepard in danger. I'm doing what? Who is this? Hang on. Joker mentioned staff analyst Brooks, yes? That's her. Everybody me. play nice. Everybody be nice to each other. You all have my uh, number. From Easy Meat. <laughs> oh my god. Well, that sounds great. It sounds very appetizing. <laughs> we do not make anything that tastes like Krogan and certainly not barbecue as sorry. That is not Ooh. the sort of business we do. Please restrict your order to what's in the official catalog. Sincerely, Gret Bast, Shipping Director, Easy Meat Incorporated. That's, that's also, fucked up. Also, cantaloupes? Question mark? Huh, I mean... Kind of? Cantaloupes are great. I love delicious. cantaloupe. This is a very strong pistol. <laughs> it is an incredibly strong pistol. <laughs> That's nice. Reports are coming in of gunfire on the Silver Sun Strip. Stay tuned for updates right here on the Alliance News Network. Let's just meet. Oh, what just happened? <laughs> Wait. Can I recreate? I think I stood on it for like half a second. Festas, I know you're licking the fruit. I'm not around. Stop that. Gross. Seriously. Oh, look, look, look at this cute little. <laughs> that is cute. I'll try to override it. It's like, oh, we're all pals together. <laughs> That's nice. Fish dog food shack. <laughs> Let's go. Let's see. What am I missing? And what's a fish dog? Is that like a like a sea lion? Uh, yeah, good question. Oh hey, we're a specter that lets us in. <laughs> nice. Damn it. what's happening? I heard that Oh, hi. Good. Oh, <laughs> sir, can I please? There, there we go. Not helping, <laughs> hi. All right, who still wants some of you? Those are just mannequins. I was like, huh? <laughs> are they just A-posing down there? Oh, there they are. I, I thought so. 
You, you can't believe it, huh? I want to look at these shops. Con conjunction. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Uh, Shasta, Shasta, darlings. Blah, I don't know why I couldn't say that name. <laughs> Look, here's the deal. You can't say stuff like that to Giala. She will freak out. I swear to you, her blue head will pop right off. I doubt her dad was a Vorcha. Sort of doubt it. V. <laughs> don't you like this spy music? Yeah. <laughs> All staff, I am aware some of you are considering leaving my employ and working for those hussies over at my car. <laughs> they don't care about you like I care. I super care about you. And the good kind of caring, not the creepy kind. Solocious Vest Manager Van Allen Belts. Right. I don't know who wrote these, but they're hilarious. Yeah. Oh, welcome to Claire's. Look at this shiny. <laughs> Variables. <laughs> <laughs> I think I tore my ACL doing something extreme. <laughs> Starting to black out from the pain. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Give a the Gibster Gblansky. P.S. Okay, guys, really, I'm blanking out. <laughs> wow. You know, did you ever watch? Um... <laughs> Metalocalypse? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you know the clown guy? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Kind of <laughs> reminded me of that, like, kind of those vibes. Do not leave bags unattended in the marketplace. That's a lot of grenades. Yeah, I accidentally hit that shockwave, so you're just going to get all in the back. Hello? <laughs> you too. I, I know you're there. There you are. Right in the elbow. Against the way they decided to do Brooks, but oh yeah, we quirky. <laughs> Service. Don't ask me why there's so much ammo everywhere. Don't worry about it. They're just gonna sit down and die right here. So, <laughs> bad day, Shepard. You could say that. Landing pad is just over there, but it's behind a locked gate. Let's look for a control panel. Nice outfit. Control panel, right? <laughs> <laughs> Word is you fell through a fish tank. We'll talk about it later. A damn shame. Great food there. We'll talk about it later. <laughs> oh, you can look at all of these decision motors. Decision Dauntless. Oh my god, Blech. I forgot you can look at these. Decision Gallant. Oh my goodness. Alright, let's see here. Gate controls. Also, hi, Garrus. <laughs> Let's max out your um your armor piercing stuff. Health and armor damage or cover penetration? Decreases the you effectiveness know, to armor targets, but uh You know, health and armor, you just can't go wrong with it. Let's go. Look so this is this is I believe what is colloquially known as the Archangel build. 
I think this is the Ooh. where you base you leave proximity mine low and you give him maxed out everything else. You can there are situations where you can just sit behind cover and Garrus will take care of everything. Wow, amazing. He's quite powerful. Where can I get a boyfriend like that? <laughs> Stand back. Hold on. Suddenly he doesn't have his helmet on, don't worry about it. Hi. <laughs> uh, could you open this up? Much appreciated. Please leave. <laughs> this poor guy. <laughs> <laughs> This is the look he gives you, he's like, huh? Eh? Huh? Eh? Oh my god, the music. Decision <laughs> motors, you pay now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at it's all shiny. Wow. Uh oh. <laughs> yeah. Hi, Rex. <laughs> <laughs> Doing here. Ah, just butting heads with the council over Krogan expansion. Survive. Could it be fast? Yeah. Hi, Rex. Yeah, we got Rex on the team. Hang on a second there, nice. Rexy boy. We got Rex on the team. Whoa. Okay, first. Health and shield or weapons? Um but like 40% is a mm. lot. Is a lot. Yeah. Alright, power damage by 20. Decrease shield recharge delay by 20. Um, gotta go with power damage. Power damage. Squad mate health and shields by 20%. Or the, his own health and shield bonuses and melee damage. Um, so this is just for him. This is for everybody. Yeah, you know, let's do squad mate health and shields. Let's go. Um, let's see here. Carnage is always good. Impact radius or damage? Um, let's go for impact radius. Kabooms. Incapacitate enemies, knocking them down, or increase recharge speed because it's 27 seconds down to 20. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that probably would be good. Recharge, the recharge. All right. Increase damage by 50% or damage specifically to armored units by 65. Hmm. Maybe the other one. Yeah, the general damage. Yeah, general damage, yeah. All right. 
Let's see. I forget what stimulant pack is. Specially designed op survival pack temporarily increases survivability and all damage output. Okay. Let's. He also has lift grenades. Um, nice. Uh, so between lift grenade barrier and stimulant pack, which one would you like to ignore? <laughs> Essentially, because uh, they're already all ready to three. You know, how about let's ignore stimulant pack? Yeah, I think it's yeah. Yeah, it's like basically he pops them and he gets a boost, but he's already really tough. Like this would be right. great on a on a squishier character. Mm -hmm. But and he also has barrier. Yeah, <laughs> like, that seems like that's good. We want right. to use that. Um, so when he detonates it, we can increase damage force and radius, or we can simply decrease his uh, damage taken while the barrier is up by another five percent. It's currently by default it's an extra fifteen percent. We can put it up to twenty, or we can make the radius of the blast be bigger. Essentially, Ooh, yeah. Let's go for blast. Blast effect. Uh, shield recharge. So shield regens um, are tend to be a little slower when you've got the barrier up because it's okay. eating that damage, right? Um, or we mm -hmm. can increase. So it uh, increases the regenerate or of your shield, or increase damage in force while the barrier is active. So take things out faster. Interesting. So increase your um, shield regen or increase damage and force. I think we better go for safety first. Safety and in that first. case, I think we should go for the shield. All right. Final one, reduce power speed penalty by 30%. So, you know, when he's got the barrier up, things aren't don't go too mm -hmm. slow. Or general damage protection by 10%. Um, his defense seems pretty good already. Quite strong. <laughs> yeah, so I kind of feel like maybe do the um, penalty. Uh, yeah, lower. Yeah, that's yeah, usually yeah, what yeah. I end up doing too because I like him to be able to do his stuff. All right, yeah. grenades, increased damage or impact radius. Both are thirty percent. Let's go for the impact radius. It is a grenade after all. Power duration, so the the length of the lift essentially could lift them up or. He can carry another two. Increase the capacity mm. by two. I think I think right now he's probably got three on him. Two or three. Okay. So a uh, grenade capacity by two or power duration. Uh, no, let's go for power duration. All right. Damage by 30% and impact radius by 30%. Or slam floating targets to the ground when the lift wears off, stunning them. Ooh. These are both good. <laughs> you know, that one is good, but I think the damage and radius is still better. Right. We'll do that. Oh, he needs one more. <gasps> oh, well, we'll save that. We'll save that one. Shuttle. What? A little busy right now. Right, sorry. We'll be there soon. Y'all should maybe stop dropping in. I'm just saying. <laughs> Almost there, Commander. Hang on. Like, you're not even being allowed to do anything. Right. Great place to fight it. Lots to destroy. I know you're having fun, Rex. I'm glad. <laughs> Cool gun. It's that. yeah. Sorry, I'm late. Had to take the scenic route. Scenic route? We nearly crashed four times. Where the hell did you learn to drive? And Brooks says hi. <laughs> oh, you want to do that? Back to the extraction zone. Let's go, guys. Good to go, Commander. <laughs> yes, I'm here.
Someone want to tell me what's going on here? I didn't recognize those mercs. Heavily armed and using C-Sec shuttles. I don't know. I've never seen them before. I can't believe you survived all that. They had guns and grenades and those drone things. So C-Sec, um, <laughs> it's okay. It yeah. It's all right. I'm calling Commander Bailey. See what's going on with C-Sec. Okay, that sounds... Wait! Wouldn't that just make whoever you contact a target too? She's right, Shepard. Until we figure this out, it's a big risk. Okay. For now, we run this ourselves. Right. Ourselves. On our own. Outside the law. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know... We're nice. You're doing mm -hmm. fine. Mm-hmm. Doing fine, Brooks. It's okay. I know this is a lot to deal with. I got shot. I got medigel, but still, I took a desk job explicitly to not get shot. And you killed a hundred guys with a pistol! Well, yes, that did happen. I mean, <laughs> who does that? Well, you, I guess. But besides you, they said the medigel might make me jumpy. Do I seem jumpy? How did you get mixed up in this? <laughs> I monitored data for Alliance Intel to prevent fraud and hacking of officer IDs. Like, uh, someone using an Admiral's pass to get into a nightclub on the Citadel when that Admiral is fighting on Tuchanka. I wrote a tracking program. It's really neat. I named it Mr. Biscuits, after my cat. Brooks. Right, sorry. Anyway, Mr. Bis- uh, My program detected a breach in your classified files. <laughs> Soon, everything we had on you was compromised. Personnel files, mission reports, everything. Since when does hacking personnel records involve heavy weapon fire? Think of what criminals could do if they had Shepard's military access codes. Or Spectre codes, even. Explains why they need you dead, Shepard. Nothing to stop them till the damage is done. <laughs> I'd say, you know... Yes, shore leave is cancelled. For the moment. <laughs> this is, yeah, but... This is this a critical. Okay. Let's figure out who they are and shut them down. Ideas? Well, I was looking at that pistol you picked up. For such a tiny thing, it packs a punch. Never seen anything like it before. Let me see it. I might be able to help. Glyph. Da hi, Liara. Relevant <laughs> intel for review, Dr. Kasoni. <laughs> Liara. Shepard. I'm relieved to see you're in one piece. A shame about the sushi place, though. It was a favorite. I hear that. <laughs> All right, the hour's on point. What about the rest of the crew? Yeah, what about those slackers? Joker, you've been busy. I found some folks who actually like being shot at. Permission to come aboard, Shepard? <laughs> Hi, everybody. Welcome to the apartment. 